Hi there, my name's Alicia and I'm the Assistant Curator at Petersfield Museum. Over the next few weeks we're going to be sharing some videos that tell you a little bit more about the stories and the objects in our collection in 60 seconds, so let's get started. The first object that we're going to be talking about is this penny farthing. A little bit about penny farthings themselves, so they were first invented in the early 1870s. The reason for the big wheel at the front was that one turn of that wheel could make the bike go further. As you can imagine, penny farthings weren't really that safe to ride. The position of the rider above the wheel and the height meant that if you hit a bump it was very easy to be thrown off and break bones. Onto Petersfield Museum's penny farthing. It was made in 1871 on the Isle of Wight and it was owned by a man called Henry Holder. And here we actually have a photo of the Holder family. You can see Henry on the right there with his penny farthing. It was actually in the Holder family for many generations and eventually in the 90s a descendant decided to offer it as a donation to the Petersfield Area Historical Society. The chairman of the society at the time, Wilf Burnham, went to collect it and according to him he wheeled it back through the streets of Petersfield to take it to a safe place and all of the traffic stopped at this really weird site. So I hope you've enjoyed this very brief summary of Petersfield Museum's Penny Farthing but if you do have any questions or comments then comment below and we'll get back to you. Let us know if there's any objects that you would like to hear about as well. Thanks for watching.